Welcome back to this tutorial on getting started with web development using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript inside the Visual Studio Code. I'll walk you through the steps to set up your development environment, create a basic web page, and see it in action. But before we do so, please make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't, and like the video as well. So let's get straight into it then. First, we need to set up Visual Studio Code and create a new project. Go to Visual Studio, go to code.visualstudio.com, which is, or you can Google Visual Studio Code, and this this resort here, as you can see, gives you the link to code.visualstudio.com. So you click on it, click on it, and here, obviously, you can download your Visual Studio Code from here. Okay. But we're not looking too much into that. But you got to make sure that you have Visual Studio Code downloaded and installed. Okay, so let's get straight back into it again. So here, once you have your Visual Studio open, so this will be the, the welcome page here. Yeah? So let's go ahead and click on Open Folder. So here, as you can see, yeah, we're going to create a new folder. Yeah. So we right click it, new, create a new folder. We're just gonna name it YT website, just for YouTube website, yeah, for, just for this video, okay? And we select it. So this is what we've, we've got here. We have the, the folder open, the YT website open. So first of all, let's go ahead and add a new file. So let's call this file index dot html okay let's go ahead and add folder let's call this folder css let's add one more folder call it js obviously js for javascript yeah so as you can see here, we've got the basic setup for our website but before we continue we've got to make sure we we also install this um um we have, we have to make sure we install this extension as well. So as you can see, I've got this extension installed here. Yeah? It's called Live Server. Live Server. So you can type here Live Server if you don't have it. Yeah, so this will be actually provided. So as you can see, I installed the first bit here, which has got uh, over 50 million um, installation. Okay. So once you're done with this bit here, then we come back to this page again. Okay? The file page here. So let's open our index.html now. And here, this is what we're going to type in. So this is what we're going to type in here. I'm, I'm just going to copy and paste it to make the video faster. So you can have a look and type it yourself. But this is a very simple. If you're if you're familiar with web development, then it shouldn't be a problem. Okay. So once you're done with this bit here, you go ahead. And we expand our CSS. Okay, so the CSS we're going to add a we're going to add a new file. Okay, and we're just going to call it site. dot CSS. Very simple stuff here. So we open it. And we're just going to put something very simple here, like body. So let's put the body. Let's put a background color. And let's just put any color that you want. Just put any color you want, yeah. This, this is just for this video. So let's leave let, just let's leave it here as it is, okay? And let's open the, the JavaScript folder and add a new file. So we're just gonna call it index.js. Yeah, so this will be our JavaScript file, okay? So here also, we're just going to add something very simple here, but just to keep the time at bare minimum, I'm just going to um, paste it, okay? So this is what we're going to add to the JavaScript, yeah? So it's a very simple event listener. So I will explain it further once we start running the application, okay? So let's go ahead and save it. So let's save all, okay? So let's come back to the index 
index.html. So let's add our links to it. So the where will be, this will be our style sheet. And the link will be um, our folder and then the cycle. Yes, so this will be our, this will be the link to our, our style sheet. Yes, so let's go ahead and add the, the JavaScript as well. So let's put our link and um, so, um, sorry, just gonna put our script instead. I mean, we have script, um, the source of the script, this will be, let's go ahead and add our JS folder and then the JS doc. Okay, so basically we've added our star sheet and the, the um, the JavaScript to the code, yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and save all. Okay, so if you have installed the extension, yes, let's go ahead and click go live. Yeah, so as you can see here now, we've got some issues here. So let's go back and have a look at what issues that we have. So let me close this here and let's rerun it again. So as you can see, I supposed to show the, the, the background color for the body, but for some reason it's not showing. So let me have a look at what we have for that. What we have inside the in desktop. Okay, so let's go ahead. So as you can see here, I've got a very simple mistake here, so let's remove it and put it here. So this this should work fine now. So let's save all and and reopen it, go live again. So as you can see here now, we've got the background color changed, and we obviously we've got our, our JavaScript working. So it's actually saying welcome to my first website. Okay, so as you can see here now, to stitch them all together is not very difficult. So I'll leave it here for you to continue working on it yourself. So I hope this helped you to get started in terms of using a Visual Studio code and creating your first website. So if that's the case, make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel for more videos. I hope you have a lovely morning, evening, afternoon, wherever you are. Peace.